years. And for the first time since restarting its program, Houston Baptist is there, thanks to a guy with a unique name who's sharing more of his secrets with our Daniel Gotera. At the NCAA Outdoor Track and Field Championships this week, Houston Baptist will be well represented. His name is Denim Rogers. He competes in the decathlon. He's got a great story, so we're going to let him tell it. Ten things you need to know about this Olympic hopeful. I was adopted when I was three, and I just met my biological mom about two years ago. I asked her why she named me Denim, and she told me that she and my father went through a cowboy phase and named me Denim after jeans and my brother Stetson after a cowboy hat. My biological last name is Hot, H-O-T-T. -T. Denim White Hot Rogers would be the full extension of my name. I grew up in a small town called Whitesboro. There's like 3,000 people there maybe. They usually graduate around 60 to 70 people. I go to a junior college coming out my sophomore year and ended up uh, winning the indoor uh, heptathlon at nationals and, and breaking the national record. I have two decathlon tattoos. I have uh, got my arm sleeve that has several events. It doesn't have all 10, but it's got several. And indoor this past season, uh, I was uh, one person ended up scratching, making me two points off of going to the indoor national championships, which is, as we all know, the hardest one to get into. And this year, I actually just, uh, I started at St. Agnes, uh, coaching their girl high jumpers. Uh, so I've been coaching for the last three years. I listen to a number of things, really. I just, I pretty much put all my songs on shuffle and whatever comes on. Last thing is, I'm the biggest Spider-Man fan there is. So got uh, my cars all decked out and I got plenty of tattoos for Spider-Man too. And that's me. See you guys on the track.